A 7 Action News investigation sent former Justice Diane Hathaway to prison, and tonight she's hoping a judge's leniency will send her home. 7 Action News investigator Ross Jones has the new information. Ex-State Supreme Court Justice Diane Hathaway has only spent about five months in prison, and in a filing released today, she says that's plenty. She reported a federal prison in West Virginia last August, sentenced to a year and a day behind bars after pleading guilty to bank fraud, liquidating accounts and hiding homes from her bank, all so she could get out from her $600,000 mortgage. The scheme was exposed by a Seven Action News investigation. Shouldn't you respond to these? These are important questions, Your Honor. Hathaway is asking that she leave the minimum security camp cupcake, finishing off her sentence in either a halfway house or, better yet, her house under home confinement. She'd been living in this waterfront floor to home before reporting to prison. It's the same one she fraudulently hid in a stepdaughter's name. She learned the values of toughness, hard work, integrity. And today we got our first look at just what the ex-justice has been up to behind bars. The woman who used to write nuanced legal briefs and lecture college courses has been spending her time a little differently lately, taking classes in basic parenting, nutrition and yoga, even taking a 75-hour course in brisk walking. Hathaway submitted these certificates of achievement to the court, saying they're proof that she's learned her lesson. In Southfield tonight, I'm Ross Jones, 7 Action News.